I'm Trisha Keen. Right now on your 13 Action News update, the Brazilian variant of COVID-19 is now here in Clark County. Local health officials say there have only been three reported cases so far, and that includes a man in his 20s who had one dose of the vaccine and was not hospitalized. The other two cases are men in their 30s and 40s. Neither have been vaccinated or are hospitalized at this time. Researchers say this variant can be twice as transmissible as the original virus. Boulder City is ending COVID-19 testing next week. To be clear, this only applies to testing run by the city. You can still get tested at pharmacies and urgent cares. Officials say they are seeing less and less people being tested. The final two events are happening on Bullock Field Drive near Boulder City Parkway tomorrow and next Tuesday. You can drive up between 8 and noon and again between 1 and 3 p.m. Well, new at 6 tonight, NHP troopers saying goodbye to one of their canine officers. This is Jill, and she passed away after suffering a medical emergency last night. The five-year-old Springer Spaniel helped officers track down drugs. When she wasn't working, Jill loved visiting kids at local elementary schools and getting belly rubs as well. Danny. The calm conditions continue for your Monday night with really mild temperatures, 70s through dinner time before falling to the 60s overnight into Tuesday morning. We'll start calm and clear Tuesday morning, but the gusty wind really increases for the second half of the day with a wind advisory and a red flag warning going into effect at 11 a.m. lasting through 10 p.m. for the majority of the region. By tomorrow evening, we expect gust speeds to approach and at times exceed 45 miles per hour. This helps to bring in more seasonal conditions for the end of the week as our highs fall to the 70s. All right, and that was your 13 Action News update. You can always get the latest news at KTNV.com.